Hey guys, it's Lindsay with LinkyLouville.com. Today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to use batch processing to do some relatively simple edits to an entire folder. This is a really good tool for, um, like when I give clients a disc, I'll edit all the, the color ones and then I'll do batch processing of black and white, which is actually what I'm going to do right now because instead of spending an entire hour switching, you know, those 20, 30, 40 photos into black and white, I can do this batch processing, do the entire batch all together so they look relatively similar and consistent and it takes me five, three minutes to set up and then I can walk away from my computer and it takes care of it. So first what we have to do is create the action that the batch processing is going to apply to every single photo. So I have the first photo I'm going to start off with. This is one of the photos from Zoe and Claire a um, couple weeks back, back in the leaves in our backyard. So what I'm going to do is go into my actions and I have this batch processing which is where I have all my batch processing ones and I'm going to start a new one and we're going to call it Claire and Zoe black and white and hit record. Now what I want to do, I like, I I have a few of the four Bella action sets and I absolutely love this vintage chocolate. It's amazing. Best black and white action ever. Um, it's got a little bit of warm chocolatey brown tones so I hit play let that run through and then I flatten which I just do shift control E and it merges your visible and then go to file save as or shift control S save it as a copy hit save OK and then close don't save. And if you don't know, Control W closes. So we'll hit stop and now you can see it says play action, merge visible, save, close. So now we're going to go up into file or yeah, file, automate, batch. Make sure that out of all my things, this batch processing one is picked. We're going to pick Claire and Zoe black and white. Then we're going to choose the folder that we want to use. Zoe and in the leaves, standard color, click OK, and then hit OK. And then it's going to run through all the pictures. Okay, and we're done. And this is one of those things, you know, if you had like a big wedding, you could just set it and forget it. And there we go. There's all of our pictures. Black and white copy, color copy, black and white copy, color copy, black and white copy, color copy. Super simple, super fun. And yeah, thanks for watching. Um, if you guys have any other things you'd like to see in videos, for tutorials, let me know, leave me a comment, or send me an email. Talk to you soon.